we got a very important question for our next break. Oh, oh do we? Yeah. We have a burning We're, question? We got a burning question straight. Uh, we got a burning question whoa. straight from Travis. I think it's probably a a very commercially minded question. I want to know where, where, we, where can we get some merch and where can we get some music? Oh! Yeah. Yeah. That's a good talk question. about that. Like, where, yeah. where to find we, you we guys? You know, where, where, when's that your next show? Yeah. What's yeah. coming up? No problem. How can people find you? That sort of thing. Yeah. yeah. Get the Website coming I, soon. I like this song. I was grooving it this morning. Glenn was loading this stuff onto Dropbox and it kept oh, really? pop, popping up <laughs> on my you know, notification. Cool. And I kept trying to play it, and he, he changed the name or changed something because it kept cutting off. Like because I was halfway through the song. Because I was embedding the ID3 information, yeah. then I had to convert it to the right format. Oh. So I was like, that's a weird place for the song to end. And I kept because I was sort of was half listening to it as, as I was working. So. That makes sense. They want everything here, 48k, 192. Oh, uh, really? So. Sorry, I could have sent that to you. That's okay. I, I, <laughs> I have a degree in audio production yeah. as well, so it, it comes easy. Yeah. Now, a lot of other students here would not. Like, I, I can easily. And I like doing that kind of stuff. Really cool. That was like first semester stuff right there. And this, this is all we recorded. I, I, you know, I went, like I said, I went to school for production. Uh, so we recorded this literally out of my room. So. I mean, eventually we're gonna actually get studio recordings, and that's when we're gonna start selling albums. So right now we just, you know, demos, Reverb Nation, SoundCloud, that that's thing. Yeah, I was playing on electric, electronic drum kit. Yeah, they were I, cool you know, kid, man. Nice thing about an electronic drum kit, no bleed. Yeah, yeah. no bleed. That's true. Everything's that very true. Good already. Easy to contain, man. And then Hard if work. you don't like the sound of it, you can throw a guy yeah. on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our drum kit. And then you don't have to, you know, because you got no bleed, it's it's perfect. So you can you can set the threshold on Drumagog really really tight. Of course, you know, my latest track is 100 percent uh MIDI. Oh really? really? Guitar, bass, keys, drums, everything. It's 100 Oh, it's all MIDI? Yeah, it's all easy drummer. Do you use logic? Oh, yeah. yeah, Pro Tools where it's at. If you're but, uh, mix, mixing your... it, It's only supposed to be a demo. Right. And we're supposed to go back in and retrack everything at some point. Except that I have to shoot a music video next weekend for my cinematography class. Nice. And I'm using the song in the way. Because we don't have time to yeah. finish tracking it. Yeah. So hopefully. When we do track it, it doesn't look too different when I re-sync it to the music video. Like the guitar riff's not that much different, or the drumming's not that much different than what the music drummer is. Right. Yeah, that's the <laughs> bad thing about MIDI there, it's spot on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's it's but, hard to incorporate the velocity of each hit. But Easy Drummer 2, man, that's... Is that a third party thing? Easy drummer? Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's it actually beautiful. has a drum kit there. You can oh, see it. It's beautiful. What happened okay. to our music? That's, a, that's the end of okay. answers. All right. Well, I guess I dropped the ball on that one and didn't realize that we were going back on the air. So. Yeah, we started talking about gear. Oh, yeah. We, yeah. we, we, we because got, we, we love gear. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. So.